Hello guys and mga Mars, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, tayo ay magre-review ng bagong product ng uh, Girl Boss. If hindi kayo aware, um, quick background lang, Girl Boss is actually a startup company by the owner of Kikai si Maria's store. And um, they sell also um, brow products. Gaba sila ng bagong product for lips and cheeks. But they don't call it lip tints. They call it the Girl Boss Powder Tint. So this is how the packaging looks like. Anjan yung name niya, Girl Boss, and then Powder Tint, and then andito sa baba yung shade niya, which is, this one is gorgeous. So, I think this is a roll type, parang yung roller type. And then, halagay dito, locally made, cruelty free, vegan, no harmful chemicals, and then 10 ml yung product, and then it says here that the expiration date is 12 months after opening. And then shake before use. Okay, so, and under uh, KKC Maria store is actually in Facebook and in Shopee as well. And it says here, the claim of the product is matte finish, long lasting, pigmented, lightweight, non-drying on lips, and very affordable. So, I'll put the link on where to buy it sa description box na lang. And also, how much yung mismong uh, powder tint. So, if you guys are interested, please keep on watching. So, ito na nga. So, actually, I bought uh, four shades. Makikita nyo dito sa picture na nalagay ko dito sa aking side na I took photo of it. It's actually five shades but na doble yung isang shade. So, yung na, yung sweet, dalawa yung nabili ko nun. But, that's intentionally because I really wanted to uh, give it to someone close to me. So, feeling ko maganda yung shade ng sweet based on the swatches online. But, of course, uh, mas maganda pa rin yung na-swatch mo siya personally para minsan kasi iba eh. Like, for example, yung Smart. Hindi ko siya binili, yung shade na Smart. Pero, kasi na iba yung nakita ko na shade online eh. Parang ganito. Tapos, naglabas siya ng bagong swatch. Ganito pala siya. Di ba, medyo nakakalito. So, para nagsisisi ako kasi akala ko medyo purple siya or towards na siya sa violet. Kaya hindi ko siya binili. So, dapat pala kinumpleto ko na. Kasi isa na lang, kompleto ko na yung shades niya. So, here here they are. So, I have Fierce. So, buksan natin si Fierce mo na. Wait. So, naka parang vacuum sealed ba tawag dyan? First, sa naka-sealed siya. So, ganda siya. Glossy yung sticker niya. And then, yan. So, tama nga. Roll type nga siya. Roller type. So, I'll shake it first pala. Sabi, shake well before using. And then, sa swatch ko lang siya dito sa aking braso. Nag-hello pala sa inyo yung pimple ko. <laughs> na napakalaki. So, bagong tubo pa lang yun. Masakit. So, baka. Okay, medyo napag-shake ko. Medyo lumabas na yung product. <laughs> so, okay. So, I'll swatch it here. Sana maayos. <gasps> okay. Sobrang pigmented na ito. Ganda. At ang bango. Amoy fruity. Fruity scent siya. Nagandaan ko yung swatch ko. Parang hindi ako mukhang naglaslas ng ko. Okay. Okay. This is Fierce. Yes. 
sweet. So, ito yung ginabli kong pili. And then, lastly, is gorgeous. And now I will try it on my face. So, sana makaya ng labi ko tang buka ko ang swatch na to. Total apat lang na ng siya. So that's it guys, that's the swatches on my um, gradient lips, uh, full lips, and cheeks. I'm gonna wear this last shade that I put, which is the Gorgeous. And the time now is 4.05 in the afternoon. So one time na lang ako mag ate siguro yung pinakalast para lang makita natin kung paano yung um, performance niya for an oily skin. So, I think that. One eternity later. Hello guys! I'm back. So, actually, it's been 5 hours since nasa mukha ko yung um, Girl Boss Powder Tint. Actually, it's past 9 o'clock na in the evening. And as you can see, yung sa lips ko, since nag-dinner ka, nag kami, kumain ako ng fried chicken. So, syempre, medyo ma-oil yung parting skin. So, normal naman na maghulas yung lip tint na mawala siya. Pero yung outer part, meron pa din. And the good thing is, nag-iwan siya ng stain. Yun yung mahalaga. Although nawala man siya, pero may stain siyang naiwan. Oh, ang gulo ko. Mag-fade man siya, pero meron siyang stain na naiwan. 
And sa cheeks ko, as you can see, meron pa din. Naglagay lang ako ng pimple patch kasi sobrang ang sakit-sakit niya na. Meron na siyang parang maliit na mata. So, nilagyan ko na para humupa na yung pamamaga niya at mailabas na lahat ng kung anong ilalabas niya at napakasakit. So, my overall thoughts. First, sa packaging. Packaging-wise, I will give it 4 over 5. Hindi ako fan kasi ng roll type o roller type. For hygienic purposes na rin kasi. Pero kung ikaw lang naman mag-isa yung magamit, pwede mo naman siyang sigurong idiretso. Kasi, or pwede mo naman siyang idiretso ng i-apply or i-apply mo muna sa kamay mo and then saka mo siya i-spread all over your lips para hindi maghalo yung laway saka yung lip tint para hindi siya makontaminate. Ayun, para hindi magkaroon ng cross-contamination. And, syempre, pag anong type, eh, hindi pwedeng ipahiram kasi it's not, you know, it's not hygienic. And, for its price naman kasi, magka I mean, okay na sa akin na ganun talaga siya na roller type kasi hindi ako mag expect na naka-want siya tapos ganun siya ka-affordable. Oh, mamaya tayo sa price. And for blendability, I'll give it also 4 over 5 since hindi naman siya agad nagsiset. So, pag nilagay mo siya, blendable siya agad, you can spread it, and then later on, pag nag, um, pag siya ay nag-set, matte finish siya. But as you can see, although matte finish ang claim ng product, since siguro oily ako, or medyo na oilihan yung base ko, or since because oily ako, medyo nagkakaroon siya ng parang shine, which is okay naman sa akin, parang natural lang siya na glass skin. And for the pigmentation and lasting power, I'll also give 4 over 5. Kasi sobrang pigmented niya, sobrang kitang-kita mo talaga na buo yung color niya, wala ko nakita, dapat lang talaga i-shake very well para hindi magmukhang patsi-patsi siya pag in-apply mo. And then, for 5 hours, yung cheeks ko, potok na potok pa. <laughs> well, maganda talaga siya. For the finish, I'll also give it 4 over 5. I like it very much. And for the price, doon tayo magkakaalaman na yung huling-huli yung presyo. 99 pesos lang itong powder tint na ito, guys. So, very affordable siya. Estudyante ka, um, mother ka na, na naka-budget, or working individual, abot kaya ang price na to. Of, of course, plus shipping fee depending on where your location is. Pero, for 99 pesos, and nagigive niya yung ganito kagandang um, result. And for the fact na it's vegan, cruelty-free, no harmful products, locally made, sobrang sulit nun. And, um, Again, with all of my reviews, since hindi pa naman tayo sikat, my reviews and opinions are all mine. And the products that are mentioned here, or the products that is mentioned here, which is the Girl Boss Powder Tint, that is not sponsored. I bought them with my own money. So, makakaasa po kayo na magbibigay po ako ng totoong saloobin ko o totoong performance ng product. So, again... If you guys uh, wanted to buy the product, I'll put the link on the description box or the info where to buy it. And if nagustuhan nyo tong video na to, please click the like button. And, and if may mga friends kayo na super addict sa lip tints or powder tints, pwede nyo introduce sa kanila itong product na to. Share this video. And, and of course, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And I'll see you next time. This has been Maris. Yeah.